Hi everybody and welcome to General Mechanics. Uh, in today's video um, I'm going to be doing a tool review and my tool review is going to be on a brake and clutch uh, fluid tester. Um, it takes away the guesswork of knowing when your fluid is ready to be changed um, and can save you some money as well because uh, a lot of people go to garages and uh, have them checked or have it replaced um, and half the time it uh, doesn't even need doing um, so this tool works on a uh, uh, light system and if you're in the first three you're okay and if you're into the uh, three percent and four percent uh, it's time to change um, I'm going to do a test on the Honda and on the Renault because I know for a sure fact that the Renault is going to fail because it has been sat for a long time. And as you know, uh, brake and clutch fluid is uh, what's known as microscopic. So it means it absorbs water. And um, that's why your clutch and brake fluid needs replacing um, when it gets old. So what I'm going to do is I am going to um, just put you on... Uh, pause a sec while I pop the bonnet on the Honda and we will test and see what mine is Right here Hi everybody and welcome back. Right, so I've got the uh, uh, Brake and clutch fluid tester here. Um, I think you can use it for any um, of the brake fluid and clutch uh, fluid all the dot falls and all that um, I've not seen anything on the instructions that says that you can't so let's give it a go. So we we'll click the button on the top of the pen, which will give you a green light. And then what you want to do is, is take the bottom cap off of the uh, tester and put the two probes in to your uh, fluid. And if we have a look, we can see that mine is within. Uh, mine is 2%, which means it's okay. Um, so the brake fluid's okay. Let's check the clutch fluid, which is a bit more brown. So I'm Pretty confident that is going to be on the way of gone and I've got oh no I'm within okay fair enough um, I'm two percent on that as well um, so that is okay uh, let's put it down a bit further and just make sure oh no okay so I've got three percent on the clutch fluid uh, which means that that is going to be due um, to be changed uh, very soon um, so what I'll do now is I'll go and grab the keys for the red one and um, We will do a test on that which I know full well that that is going to fail When the car got hit it popped all the lids off of everything so I would imagine some water got in there So I'll just put you on uh, hold again While I go and grab the keys Right then everybody, I'm at uh, the Renault now um, and I know full well that this is going to fail I know it just is. So if I get you onto the lights and we get in there, oh, we'll have had it on first. And as you can see, we are all of them illuminated. So we have got um, four percent of water um, in this uh, brake fluid. Um, but believe it or not, actually, I'm um, going to tell you now. I tested <clears throat> a brand new bottle of Dot Four um, brake fluid, and it tested. Um, 1% um, which I was a bit annoyed about because it should be on naught um, if it's brand new and sealed which it was um, so I went back to the auto factors where I got it from and I showed them uh, this and poked it into the lid and they couldn't believe it either so we grabbed another one um, and poked it again and that one came up naught. So somewhere along the line on the uh, packaging of that um, bottle, uh, some water's got in there and contaminated it. Uh, so I think this is a great little tool. Um, it will certainly give you uh, ample warning of when it's time to change and you haven't got to go to the garage and waste loads of money uh, having it replaced when it doesn't need replacing or having it checked out. Uh, so I hope you like this one guys, uh, this is John Mechanic, signing off.